Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you my frigid warship and build a boat for Shasha. Please don't forget to like and subscribe as it really helps me out a lot to make more amazing content for you guys. And let's get straight into it. So, as you guys have known, if you watched the PvP video part 1 for the 100 sub special, you would have seen this build inside it. So, let me load it in quickly. But yeah, now let's wait for this thing to load. Now that the ship is loaded, let's do a showcase. So over here is all the credits, so I'm the main builder slash the owner. I built all the turrets and the mechanisms, the control room, the bedrooms and the armory. And I also built the medical room and lots of the details and I also built the jet. And I also done most of the room decorations. Flying octopus plays helped out with various details on the ship, like the fences and the helipad. And... He also helped with some other small details like the numbers and fixing the front. Flying Fish players helped with details inside the relaxation room. Dash Gamer built the secret area inside the ship and helped with tunnel details. Kyla M3 helped with the storage room. Lost Player underscore ES built most of the body of the ship and built some of the parts at the top. Pun helped make the front of the ship smooth. And yeah, that's basically all the contributors. So let's get into the showcase. Alright, now let's showcase the ship. So there's a lot to showcase on this ship, but first let's start off the helipad. So we've got some nice fences around and then we have a helipad here. If we move up here, we have a jet. And if you're wondering why it's not on the helipad, it cannot fit. But yeah, we have a jet just perching at the top of here and it works. I'll show you that after when we actually launch the ship. So now let's head downstairs to where all the rooms are. So if we go up here, you can see that there's different gunning sections. This one has two cannons on it. And then you can just shoot the other ones. Yeah, I don't know why it's acting like that. But here we have the medical room. So two medical beds, medical sign, and then some nicely designed medical bags with a nice wooden table. So yeah, this is the tunnel back up. The tunnel looks pretty cool in my opinion. So here's the storage room. Is legit what it sounds like storage uh, here's a relaxation room with these weird it's more like a I don't know how to explain this room I don't know what I was thinking when I made it but yeah you can sit down in it maybe like a healing pool and then we have four bedrooms so the bedrooms are quite detailed with a bedroom sign on it and yeah the beds work as well and all the four rooms are the same and this boat isn't finished yet, I still need to do the armory, which I haven't done yet. But let's go upstairs now to the front, to the control room. So we just need to head up the tunnel. Up the stairs. And yeah, so here we have four turrets. So two on this side, two on that side, surrounded by fences. And this is the control room. So if we come inside, a lot of small details, like the control panels and stuff. I made most of the details on this, so yeah. Lots of different details in the control room. Now let's go to the front of the ship before we launch it. So we just need to move down. So there's a missile here, and then there's another turret. This is a minigun turret and a cannon turret. And then these are missile launchers, I haven't figured out how to make those work. And this is a homing missile, so you'll delete the bottom block and then you'll shoot a build with the missile. And then, yeah, kaboom, explode. So let's launch the ship. There's F for the cannons, but for some reason the miniguns ain't working right now. Yep. And then for the side cannons, I mean side turrets, you can move them as well. 
and they can go up and down these ones, so I can find the right key bind. There we go. So yeah, they can go up and down as well, and then you can shoot each side separately. And then the shit up there works as well, which I'm going to show you guys now, but let's just show the homing missile quickly. So you shoot it, and then you would let go of the thing so it doesn't move your boat. And then if there was a build there, it would attach to it. But if I press this key button, the jet on anchors, and say the boat is being attacked and it gets weak, you can go to the jet. So yeah, the jet fully works, which is cool. It's one of my other jets though, and I moved it to this safe slot. So, if I can move it, come on. There we go. Yeah, that's for the cannons. And yeah, fully working jet. But that's it for this video, guys, and I'll be seeing you in the next one very, very soon. Bye.